Meghan Markle's thought-provoking launch of her latest business venture has been severely criticized by a PR expert. The Duchess of Sussex officially relaunched her Instagram account to promote her new lifestyle brand, American Riviera Orchard, only a week after she spoke of the dangers of social media at a women's panel in Texas and just hours before Prince William gave a speech at an event in London. The account, which had amassed 345,000 followers by Friday midday, featured a logo, a new crest, a bio that said by Meghan, the Duchess of Sussex and linked to a website where people can join a waiting list. Meghan's new brand will reportedly focus on lifestyle and cooking and will likely coincide with the launch of a new cooking show on Netflix, according to sources. But a PR expert questioned the intentions behind the former Suits actress launch and touched down on its timing, as well as her decision to use social media after expressing the desire to keep her distance. Renee Smith, founder of The Atticism, told Express.co.uk, the question of whether Meghan's timing for launching her new venture, coinciding with Prince William's speech, was deliberate is indeed thought-provoking. Without insider knowledge, it's challenging to assert if there was any intentional overlap with the royal schedule. Given Meghan's expressed distance from the royal family, and the unlikely event she has access to their schedules, it's plausible that any timing overlap was coincidental. However, in public relations, perception often equals reality. Therefore, even unintentional overlaps can lead to speculation about underlying motives. It highlights the importance of strategic timing in announcements, especially when past affiliations might invite added scrutiny. Ms. Smith branded Meghan's decision to engage in social media so shortly after opening up about the cruel online abuse she received while pregnant a paradox as well as a strategic approach to media management. Last Friday, the Duchess bravely opened up about how she faced cruel online bullying and abuse during her pregnancies, during a powerful speech at the South by Southwest Festival, South by Southwest, in Texas. Meghan said, I keep my distance from, social media, right now just for my own well-being. The bulk of the bullying and abuse that I was experiencing in social media and online was when I was pregnant with Archie and with Lily, and with a newborn. It's not catty. It's cruel. Now Ms. Smith explained, Meghan's re-engagement with social media, despite her avowed intent to keep her distance, presents a paradox that many in public relations grapple with balancing personal principles against professional imperatives.